Hello guys, hope you are doing well and welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, I shall inform you how you can solve the uh, keyboard problem in uh, Lenovo PC. So my laptop is uh, Lenovo IdeaPad 330 and uh, after Windows update, uh, the Windows has got updated to Windows 11 Pro. So after this update, the keyboard was not working. So how you can solve this problem? So today I shall show you. So let's uh, start. Here you can see that the system information. So in this system information, you can see that the it is 64 feet operating system and the edition here you can see that edition is Windows 11 Pro and uh, installed on 9-12-2021 and these are all about the windows information so it has got updated to windows 11 pro so and uh, you can see that my if i go here and type something say uh, google uh, say chrome so uh, google uh, google chrome so you can see that the keyboard is working okay now <coughs> Uh, so how can I how I how have I achieved this so initially I have gone to the device manager so uh, when keyboard does not work so you need to go to here and uh, you have to right click over here and uh, you need to go to the uh, device manager from here because your keyboard at that moment will not work okay now i have come here and uh, i have uh, gone to the uh, drivers basically the keyboard driver you have to find out the, where is your keyboard driver uh, let me check mice and other uh, pointing network where is the keyboard driver batteries bluetooth uh, hardware human interface monitors yes so here you can see that keyboard driver so here you can see that the standard pc2 uh, keyboard driver okay so now the, there was a problem in this driver once the uh, windows got updated so there will be some uh, warning message here but here you can see that's no warning message and standard ps2 keyboard has been installed here so um, initially you can uh, i have just tried to uninstall and update it but that don't work so you will need to do some other works to get it corrected okay uh, <coughs> and earlier the driver was also different so driver was something uh, that was not this driver it was a different driver i cannot recall that at this moment but the driver was not uh, this standard ps2 keyboard okay that was some other drivers okay now I have gone to the Dell website and uh, sorry it's uh, Lenovo's website and uh, after going to the Lenovo's website you need to download uh, some drivers okay now uh, here in the download you can see this is my driver system update 5 uh, uh, system update 5.07.0131 so I have uh, uh, downloaded this driver and you can see that Lenovo system update setup so this is a Lenovo update system setup, setup and file version is uh, is 5.7.131.0 created date is 17.01.2022 okay this is the file set so after uh, uh, downloading this driver you need to run this driver as uh, run as administrator okay so after run as the administrator or uh, the bios update will be uh, done here okay so bios update will be done so after the bios update uh, update you restart your pc okay so after the bios update you need to restart your pc so after restarting that pc you might occur a, um, a screen which got some error okay which shows some error okay so when you see that error press the escape key and uh, and uh, come out from that screen then it will be uh, automatically 
start uh, loading the Lenovo PC. So after loading also you can see that the uh, you will see that uh, the keyboard still not working. So then after that you come to the device manager again and uh, come to the keyboard and you just click on the driver loaded and you just uninstall the device and then restart again. So that was the process that I have uh, done and I can see that my keyboard is working absolutely fine. So uh, if I go to the notepad, say I am opening notepad and I am again uh, <coughs> clicking uh, anything I am typing. So typing, typing anything, okay, typing anything. So you can see that it is working absolutely fine so in this way you can uh, fix the problem in your Lenovo uh, idea pad 330 so mine is Lenovo idea pad 330 now guys if I can uh, if I come to the system information and then uh, system summary here I can see that my system is uh, actually the Lenovo uh, Lenovo MT81D BU IDEA FM IDEA Pad 330. So this is basically the Lenovo 330 machine and the way that I have described in that way I have fixed this, that issue. So guys thank you for watching if you feel that this helps you please like share and subscribe my channel. And thanks again for watching.